Hi, my name is Dr. Nick Chapar, and today we'll be talking about laparoscopic peritoneal dialysis catheter placement with Omentafix. Here, as you can see, we're placing the port in a very pro-gravity fashion as opposed to perpendicular to the skin. Placement of the catheter in this manner can facilitate both infusion and drainage of the PD catheter. The catheter is then placed into the peritoneal cavity with the cuff just at the peritoneal lining. The external attachments of the catheter are performed. The catheter is tunneled up into the upper right or left upper quadrants of the abdomen. Great care is taken to make sure the peritoneal dialysis catheter is not kinked or twisted to facilitate infusion and drainage of the catheter. The catheter is readjusted several times to make sure it is in ideal positioning. And now you can see the catheter being tested. Easily flows without hindrance. Now we are proceeding with our omentopexy. Omentopexy is important for patients that have redundant omentum as this is a frequent cause of catheter obstruction. The omentum is mobilized, as you can see, for suturing of the omentum up into the upper quadrants. An energy device is used to take down any attachments of the omentum and make sure we achieve good hemostasis. Omental attachments to the colonic wall here, as you can see, are also taken down and reduced. Once the omentum is mobilized, we transfascially place a suture for our omentopexy. As the omentum is placed into the suture, the peritoneal cavity is deciflated while the omentum is being tied up to the anterior abdominal wall. This secures the omentum in the upper quadrants, minimizing any obstruction of the catheter. 